How you doing? This is my wife Judy. I'm Dale. I'm going to show you the, the, how the truck works. This is a 67 Ford Econoline van that had double doors on the other side that he cut between the double doors, moved the rear end up, built the whole frame. He customized and did all the work himself. So as you can see, one of the features is he did suicide, suicide doors. doors. Yeah. Mm. Kept the uh, dash, you know, pretty original. Okay. Then we go back here. I built the whole frame right from scratch. Uh, these were the first unitized bodies, which we basically did away with, and I built a frame for. 351 with a five speed tranny. When the cab comes down, it sits on these bags. So you get double the amount of suspension. This and the, the wheels are on airbags too. You get the pipes, the side pipes. These are the exhaust. Mm -hmm. uh, these tanks are not fuel. These are air tanks. Fuel is in here. Uh, and you got the chrome and the wheels? Yeah, got two, two rears with the drive shaft between the two. Fifth wheel. But he doesn't tow with it like everybody asks. <laughs> You can kind of see that because it's still shiny. Mm-hmm. Not all scratched up. And the cat, the whole cab goes up hydraulically, so it's just a matter of pushing the button. Let's go show them where it was cut on the other side. Hmm? When we built the the body, it used to have two doors like this. They used to open up. And that's where we chopped it in between the two doors, took the back end and move it forward to finish it off. That's, that's uh, the battery box. Uh, we've got everything. We've got an air compressor built into the, the pulleys and everything. AC. If you look down there, there's a pump it's all hydraulic to raise the, the cab up and down. Part of this uh, front end came out of a Mustang, an 88 Mustang. The back has got 8.8 .8 rears out of an 88 Mustang again. And I built everything else. Now we're going to show you how to lower the cab. All done. Ready to go down the road. So this bar is a safety bar that we put in there just in case something happens. Mm -hmm. And he's got the, the air brakes. That's yeah. another safety that he puts on too in case somebody touches something. We don't want it to just go up. So, but this was um, his dream and it took him 14 years to build this. Yeah, and again, he did all the work himself. He had to do a lot of rework because you go to do something, and you know, we change change it. And yep, just many times. Way, so, yeah. but yeah, I'm pretty proud of him. He did a great job. <laughs>